South African prosecutors have significantly increased the number of fraud and immigration charges they are bringing against Rwandan genocide suspect Fuljans Kayashima. One of the most wanted remaining suspects from the 1994 genocide, Kayashima had been on the run for more than two decades. He was arrested last month on a grape farm outside of Cape Town and had been living under a false name. South Africa's National Prosecuting Authority alleges Kayashima used a false identity in order to apply for asylum and refugee status. Outside court in Cape Town on Friday, NPA spokesman Eric Ntabazalila said the charges against Kayashima had risen from 5 to 54. That 54 includes 9 counts of fraud, 10 counts of the contravention of the Refugees Act and 35 counts of the contravention of the Immigration Act. Kayashima is expected to face extradition to Rwanda to be tried for crimes there, though Ntabazalila said those proceedings have not yet started. The former police officer is accused of ordering the deaths of 2,000 people hiding in a church. During the 100 days in which more than 800,000 minority Tutsis and Hutu moderates were killed. The case in South Africa has been postponed until June 20th for Kayashima's defence team to consult at which point he could apply for bail.